on your radio, on your TV. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Makisha868. If you guys would like to see an unboxing of this wig, as well as how I customize it to suit me, please stay tuned. Also, to all my new subscribers, thank you guys so much for joining the family. This is a protective style that I'm going to be using for Trinidad Carnival 2018. And it is a wig, it's not a sewing, it's a wig. So if you would like to see an unboxing of this wig and how I customize it, please stay tuned. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. So I purchased this wig from Wild wow African. It's their curly Brazilian virgin hair in style number TLW06. And it's 180 density. And it's a 360 frontal wig. I got this wig in 16 inches, natural color, cap size small, and the lace color medium brown. And it is a pre-plucked hairline. I'm gonna take the hair net off. Nice. They're really tight and the brown it looks kind of black on camera but it is like I'll say like a number two between a number two and a number four. See the inside of the cap. 360 all the way around there's lace and then the middle right here is wefted here. My hair is not as flat as I would have liked it to be but I'll make do. So the 360 allows you to pull the hair up. I think this is it. This is my plan A for Trinidad Carnival 2018. Let's hope it cooperates and it works. But I'm gonna go wash it and I'll be right back. So right here, I'm just washing the hair. I'm using Suave Moroccan Shampoo. And I did get a bit of shedding in this washing process, as shown on the side of the sink. So next I'm going in with my Silicon Mix Deep Conditioner, and I love using this deep conditioner in all my extensions. So I'm just applying that and letting it sit for a couple hours. So I've already gone in with a lot of body throughout the hair and it's about 80% dry. Now I'm just going to spritz it with some water and this is my 360 bottle just to reactivate the lot of body. Once I'm done doing that, I'm going in with my Miel Organics Curly Mousse and just applying that throughout the hair. Next, I'm using my Denman brush just to clump the curls together and give me some more definition. You can see how easily this Denman brush is gliding throughout the hair. Now in this section, the hair is completely dry and I'm just going around and cutting off the lace. Right here is in real time, but pretty soon I'm going to fast forward it. But I'm definitely taking my time. When you're cutting off lace, you want to make sure you're taking your time. Here it is in real time again, carefully cutting off the lace. So now in this part of the video, I'm going to show you my braid pattern. Now to have the wig lay as flat as possible, I'm attaching an elastic band around the perimeter of the inside of the wig just so it can fit 
more snug onto my hairline. So I'm using one of the combs that I removed from the inside and just to carve out the baby hairs so I can raise them down. And to razor them, I'm using an eyebrow razor just to cut them down a bit. These baby hairs come really, really long. Once I'm done doing that, I'm taking some more Neo Organics mousse and just laying down the hairs. I also go in with some Eco Styler gel on my edges. Right here, I'm adding some foundation powder just to camouflage my part a little bit more and to hide the lace. So here are the final results of this wig. I'll show you the back. I really like the curl pattern. The hair is very soft. So far, I did get some shedding while I was washing it as I showed in that clip. So far, so good. I know some people like using the Got To Be Blue, but this wig is definitely gonna be coming off every night while I'm in Trinidad. I'm not gonna be sleeping with this wig on. So, Got To Be Blue will not work for me because I'm not gonna be keeping the wig on 24 seven. Just for my pets and when I go out and on the road. So, I'm not gonna be using Got To Be Blue, my last wig. Um, for my first wigs, I'll leave that linked over here. I did it the same way and that worked out well for me. I used the elastic band and I just used um, Eco Salad Gel on my edges and I was good to go. So if you have been watching my last couple of videos, you will have seen that I have been rocking this wig in those videos. Just a few screenshots from those videos. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll leave a link to this wig in the description bar below. Thank you to all the new subscribers. If you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and do so. Thank you guys so much. Thanks for watching.